What kind of example does paying women less set for our sons and daughters? So today we're taking one more step in the right direction. We are proposing to collect and report pay data by race, ethnicity, and gender from businesses with 100 employees or more. And the goal is to help businesses that are trying to do the right thing, like the ones here today, to get a clear picture of how they can ensure their employees are being treated equally. A better picture of the data will also help us do a better job enforcing existing equal pay laws. Now, this won't solve every problem. We've still got to get more women and girls into high-paying fields like science and technology, engineering and math. We still got to make sure that women are not penalized or held back uh, in the workplace simply for starting a family. And we're going to keep pushing until every single girl has the rights and the opportunities and the freedom to go as far as her dreams will take her.